Hello Booster Brickers and Lego fans. We are working on our May to July, or May to June, Booster Bricks Challenge Box. Theme is Pet Palooza and volunteering in general. We've already made our minifigure, which is a shelter volunteer named Kelly. And we're at the point in the story where she is searching for a muddy little puppy that she's supposed to be cleaning up. As she's searching the shelter, she finds herself in the reptile room. And our micro build challenge now is to build a reptile habitat. We will use just the pieces in the micro build challenge pack to create a reptile habitat. Should be interesting. Let's open her up, see what pieces we have to work with. The card makes a nice background for a photograph. Turn it around, you can put your name on it as well. Couple runaway pieces here. All right, we've got an assortment, some round, square, flat plates and bricks. A little bit of everything it looks like. Let me give this some thought and get to building. I've got my pieces sorted. I've taken a look. My initial thought was to build like an aquarium container. And I don't think I can do that with these pieces. So instead, I'm going to try and focus on the actual habitat. What would be inside the aquarium or the box. The stuff that reptiles would climb on, where they would drink places for them to hide. I'm going to see what I can build using these pieces that resembles a reptile habitat. You can either pause the video and build along and come back and see, compare what we've built, or you can go ahead and watch to the end, see what I come up with, and then do your own build. Either way, it's up to you, but I will be right back. And I'm done. I used all but one piece because it's an eyeball and this is supposed to be an empty reptile habitat. So I didn't know where to put the eye. <clears throat> Aside from that, like I said, we were focusing on creating what would be inside the aquarium or container. And so we've got this set up. It's got lots of hiding places. Places to crawl and climb, heat lamps all around, There's plenty of nice little warm places. There's an air filter. This is where it, the air is pulled in. It goes through a filter and comes back out. Got a little water fountain here. Here's my other part of that. little bit of everything. I think reptiles would be happy in here. What did you guys build? Did you come up with anything like this or did it look a lot different? Probably looked a lot different and that's just fine. It's all about creativity and using what you have the best you can. So I'm going to take a picture of this build and submit it to the Facebook page for a chance to win a prize. 
And don't forget about Kelly back here, our shelter volunteer. She's she's searching right now for that puppy dog. Until next time, <clears throat> thanks for watching Amy's Lego channel and happy building.